News 8 Storm Team Forecast with Chief Meteorologist Joe Calhoun. I've been telling you all week, the weekend forecasts all contingent upon Bill, and what's left of Bill. Well, it could bring us some heavier rain. It was once a tropical storm, and that could come Saturday night into Sunday morning. And there is a flood watch up. Main concern small streams and creeks. The larger creeks, the rivers, not a problem. Maybe a little bit of uh, street flooding. Again, that would come tomorrow night. But it may be a good, good timing because it may be out of here for most of uh, the day on Sunday, on Father's Day. Watching a little bit of shower activity, some coming down into parts of the Lebanon Valley. Get to that in a second. A little bit more out here over the uh, Laurel Highlands. That may kind of clip us as we go through the evening hours. A little more maybe late tonight. Look at the temperature differences. 70s, even 60s up in Erie. Well, most of us from here southbound, 80s and even near 90 degrees to get down toward Richmond. It's a frontal boundary. I thought that might get through here and give us a little comfort, a little bit tonight, but it's going to be nearby, so we've got to keep that thread of a shower in. But again, I just look for spotty stuff as we go on through the, after, or through the evening hours. Here's that area I was talking about coming through the Lebanon Valley. As it's been moving southbound, it really has been weakening. We'll zoom, uh, I'll show you the temperatures first of all. Mid 80s, some spots 70s. Uh, in fact, Lebanon got a little bit of rain at the airport there, and it now has uh, cooled it down a little bit to 72 degrees. Most of the rain is now pushing down into parts of uh, northern Lancaster County and over toward Berks County. We see a little bit of light rain in and around the Lebanon, Schaeferstown, Myerstown area right now. In fact, the Lebanon Valley looking a little gray, a little overcast, and still a few raindrops on the camera lens right now. Officially, Lebanon at 72 with calm winds and a dew point still at 68. So we head to Myerstown for the forecast for this evening. Partly sunny, again, spotty shower early, warm and sticky otherwise. Could be a rumble of thunder, but I don't look for much. A few more showers may come in late tonight, maybe even a thunder shower overnight tonight. Get a little break tomorrow morning, then a few more showers may pop up. Looks like later in the day is when they become a little more numerous and maybe even some thunderstorms there. Weathering your health for tomorrow, no big problems there. In fact, the UV index will be a little lower for tomorrow because of cloud cover. Let's time it out. There's those showers moving out. We get a little break. Later tonight, maybe get a few coming through. Tomorrow morning, maybe spotty stuff, but you notice by tomorrow afternoon, it becomes a little more numerous. Watch what happens as we go into tomorrow night. Yeah, there's that heavy rain, but boom, it's quickly out by Sunday morning. We even get a little sunshine Sunday afternoon. May warm it up closer to 90 degrees by Sunday afternoon. So, not a bad weekend, but again, we'll have to dodge some raindrops. In fact, Sunday, we could, uh, could uh, salvage most of the day. Looks like Monday's a pretty good one. Some more showers and storms come back in to the picture along about Tuesday. Drew Horn from uh, Clearview Elementary School, fifth grader there, drew our kids' art for tonight. Drew, thank you very much. That's a nice looking picture.